Well, quite a bit of uh, public money is being spent on legal settlements involving California state governments. Jackie Ward is live in the newsroom with some surprising findings. Jackie? Kenny and Michelle, we've heard of tax money being used to settle sexual harassment claims in the state legislature. But this morning we're learning that that spending reaches far beyond that. An investigation done by the Sacramento Bee reveals that more than $25 million has been spent over the last few years to settle claims against state agencies and public universities. The Bee says 21 1.3 million of that 25 million was taxpayer money, and that 92 sexual harassment settlements were reached between July 2014 and June 2017. State Senator Tony Mendoza is currently on an extended leave of absence for alleged sexual misconduct, while taxpayers continue to foot the bill for his salary. I don't know why the taxpayers should be paying this guy to stay in office. That's, that's just a travesty. We're not only paying him, we're paying his health insurance, we're paying his per diem, we're paying into his retirement account. The B reports that multiple state agencies have been involved in harassment settlements in recent years, including the Department of State Hospitals, the University of California, and the Department of Transportation, to name a few. The department that tops the list is the Department of Corrections and Rehabilitation. In the past three years, 36 claims have been settled to the tune of a little more than $15 million. In the newsroom, Jackie Ward, KPIX 5.